This week in maths, we will be learning about numbers to 100. To count to 100, we can count in tens. Let's look at what we've got here. We've got three tens, and we can count in tens. 10, 20, 30. 30. Here we have five tens. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. 50. And here we have nine tens. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. 90. We can use genes to show numbers to 100 in tens and ones. Let's count in tens and ones. We've got 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54. So our number is 54. Let's count in tens and ones. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86. Our number is 86. Let's count in tens and ones. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 91. Our number is 91. Let's see how many tens and ones are in each number. We've got 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74. 74 equals how many tens and how many ones? Let's see. There are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 tens. And how many ones? 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 ones. So 74 equals 7 tens and 4 ones. On our number bone diagram, 74 would look like 70 and 4. Let's look at this number. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66. 66 has how many tens and how many ones? Let's count. 66 has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, Six tens and how many ones? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six ones. On our number bone diagram, 66 would look like 60 and 6. Let's count this number. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. 100 equals how many tens and how many ones? Let's count the tens. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 tens. And how many ones? There are zero ones. On our number one diagram, 100 would look like 100 and zero. This week in maths, we will also be comparing numbers to 100. What number is this? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, tens. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 51, 52, 53. And this number, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67. 
So we have 53 and 67. How many tens are there in 53? Let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 tens. And how many ones? 1, 2, 3. 3 ones. And let's count how many tens and ones there are in 67. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 tens. And how many ones? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 7 ones. 6 tens is more than 5 tens. So 67 is greater than 53. And 53 is the least. Let's look at these two numbers. Here we have 82. We can count. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 81, 82. And here we have 85. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85. 82 has how many tens? Let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 tens. And how many ones? 1, 2, 2 ones. And 85 has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 tens. And how many ones? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 5 ones. The, num the, the number of tens are the same in each number, so to compare, we must look at the ones. Five ones are greater than two ones, so 85 is greater than 82. This week, we will also be learning how to make number patterns. This is called a hundred square. On our number square, we can see that if we count on twos, in twos, it is yellow. Let's use our number square to complete this number pattern. We've got 52, 54, 56. What's our next number going to be? Let's look at our number square. 58. And then in our sequence, 60. And the next number is 62. Let's try to complete this number pattern. 38, 40. What number is next in our pattern? That's right, 42, 44, 46. What number is next in our pattern? That's right, 48. We will also be counting in fives to make number patterns. Let's complete these number patterns. 25, 30. Ooh, what number's next? Well done, it's 35. 40. Ooh, what number's next? Well done, 45 and 50. And this number pattern, we've got 60 something. What number is it? Well done, 65, 70, 75, something. What number is it? Well done, it's 80 and 85. We can use our number patterns to see which numbers are one more and one less than a number. What number is one more than 46? Let's find number 46. What number is one more? One more than 46 is 47. And what number is one less than 80? Here is 80. What number is one less? One less than 80 is 79. I hope you have lots of fun learning about numbers to 100.